Yes, there, is, uh, there are these metaphysical debates about whether uh, the, the idea of free will is intelligible, and if it's intelligible, do we actually have it? And then there are the more practical questions of personal liberty and freedom. Um, in the case, let's first of all deal with the practical questions. Uh, other things being equal, uh, it's uh, desirable clearly to maximise the uh, sense of freedom and autonomy that most people uh, 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 seek to enjoy. As social primates, one can't really speak of having unlimited freedom or, and autonomy. So many of the things we desire to do, our, our preferences and desires involve others and in many cases conflict with those of other people. So com complete uh, uh, freedom in this uh, more empirical sense is, is impossible. Compromises uh, have to be made. Um, one aspect of the abolitionist project that really is worth stressing is that by focusing on hedonic recalibration, one is not in any way trying to force anyone to, uh, to adopt uh, one's own pet nostrums and ideas of the good society, that if we were naturally happier, if our set point, hedonic set point, were uh, significantly higher than it is now, we could all enjoy lives that, other things would, being equal, uh, would be more successful. We would flourish more, we could stack the genetic dice in favour of our future offspring. Um, so, yes, uh, hedonic recalibration uh, enriches quality of, of, of life without dictating uh, what kinds of lives people should lead. Um, you asked about free will also in the metaphysical sense. Uh, personally, I'm quite sceptical that it's even intelligible. Uh, if one buys into those interpretations of quantum mechanics which are indeterministic, uh, there doesn't seem any way that an indeterministic collapse of the wave function or anything like that can meaningfully confer uh, free will. Uh, I don't buy into the uh, the Copenhagen uh, interpretation with its notion of wave function collapse. As far as I uh, can understand, all that exists is the continuous linear unitary deterministic evolution of the, the universal wave function. There doesn't seem any uh, 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 scope for uh, individuals to change this. We are simply an expression of that deterministic evolution.